Look at the girl over there eating. She has no problems eating. What has she got? Ah, that looks pretty good. You killing the pepper? Somebody invited her to church. They probably thought she was a hooker. <laughs> she needed help. Jesus thanks. I mean, what can I say? You know, it's, good. it's a good thing, right? I didn't kick him or nothing, you know. That's good. We're in Greencastle, Pennsylvania, headed back to Ohio. Because that's just what we're doing, right? I ain't gonna sit around in Newark when I can be somewhere else tomorrow and get loaded. God knows we need help, right? <laughs> Back to Ohio. Oh, come on in. She said hello. Hola. Hola. All right, we don't have all right. any. We'll, be, oh. we'll get back with you, all right? Thing but steak. Sometimes I get hamburgers. And Hamb salmon. Hamburger steak. I'm still seeing results. Oh well. You're eating a bacon cheeseburger on a diet, I and know. you're over there complaining. I still, I'm, and I'm eating a steak. How can I complain about that, right? And you had eggs and salami and cheese. But a fried fish might have been good, or, or a fried piece of chicken, or some chicken gizzards, or some something fried. Actually, it's harder to eat off the buffet than you think. Yeah, the buffet's hard to eat. Yeah, you can get a salad, but most of their stuff is carbs or fried meat. Yeah. Or mixed with carbs meat. That's right. I'm going to eat this now. Y'all should eat your food, too. Hey, everybody. We had a wonderful server over here at Greencastle? Mm -hmm. Greencastle, Pennsylvania. She has got a Facebook going on. She's an artist. Check it out. I can draw really good. So, if you want to look it up, Chris and Stotler Incorporated, CSI. That's catchy. I like that. Yeah. Because with a C, Chris and with a C. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Look at that guys, beauty can be found in the most strange places, you know, you just never know where it's going to be. Hey guys, I was going to put some new boxes on this trailer like I said in the previous video, but it's going to be three grand, right? So I'm a chief master. So I will just take these here rack holders and make some wood to go across there and then strap my stuff down across here. Let's see how it turns out.
Okay guys, that just took a second, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's really hot out here. It's about 109. But anyway, with open deck trucking, and I did it for eight years before I got hurt, and I lo always loved it. It prevent uh, presents lots of new situations from driving to where you're going to where you're backing to everything for you to solve problems. Solving problems is the thing, right? This was just a little problem of money, right? Who wanted to spend $3,000 when I could do it this way? And let's see, I got three, I have three tarps here. They'll all fit on there. I still have three in this box and I'm okay with that. And I'm gonna move more equipment into this box now that it will be empty. Yay, empty is good. This is $3,000 saved, in my opinion, since I didn't buy the boxes. And I spent, what, $35? Yeah, about $35. I just happened to always carry my tools with me because you never know what you're gonna need to cut up or you know make, make, make for whatever reason. All right, we'll talk to y'all again in a little bit. I just noticed this, guys. Every time I open the door, the dog is there. Oh, and he's not there. <laughs>